there's a new bundle that's in the item shop right now it's called the gluttonous guardian bundle as you can see it comes with a couple of different things you have the mad mochi skin here with two different edit styles it says the mad mochi and the mochi masher are reactive face a smile as you play bundle includes loading screen so you can tell that it's going to be reactive those smiles that faces are all going to change looks very creepy very unique very different so i'm excited to see something that's not standard you also get the mochi masher which is going to be reactive as well has two different edit styles too pretty cool there the red bean rave so you do get a weapon wrap it looks like it's animated not reactive so we'll see that in game as well and then you get the mochi mellow roast so they this is kind of creepy but I'm definitely excited to be able to see something brand new, something very unique. So we're going to go ahead and jump in game. But before we do, make sure you hit that subscribe button if you haven't yet. Make sure you turn on notifications. That way you know every single time we upload. And go ahead and hit that like button while you're there. The support is always greatly appreciated. So let's go ahead and jump in and see what this all looks like in game. Let's go. All right. So here we have the skin free falling. The face is already pretty funny. So the middle one. Looks like he's terrified. The front one on the right arm looks like it's excited. The left arm. So it's just funny that they're going to be continuously changing on there. It definitely unique. <laughs> looks really, really interesting. So let's go ahead and deploy here. You can tell that the flower on top has physics as well as like the vines throughout the body as well. It's kind of moving there. All right, so let's take a good look at the skin here. So it's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, maybe like 10 different faces, and they're all kind of just moving, changing the emotion on there. <laughs> I like that one on the shoulder. Looks kind of derpy. It does not come with any back blings on there, so it's just the skin itself. And again, the physics on there is pretty good. Let's see if there's any reactivity to taking a big pot here. Eh? One of them smiled. <laughs> I like the one on the left. It's got like little legs. I think it said it was just going to change as you're playing the game. It doesn't seem like it's anything specific. But let's go ahead and take a good look at the pickaxe here. So the pickaxe is going to be reactive to you hitting. It smiles when you hit the critical points there. So it's got that face there. Nothing. 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 Hit the weak spot and it gets that creepy smile on there and then it'll go away yeah it's really funny so it's got a really nice contrail very very nice it's got a nice sound effect on there as well good deploy too and it's got a good splash as well I like the splash. So overall, very unique pickaxe. Got a decent reactivity. I love the contrail. So it's really, really nice details on there. And it's got a great sound effect. So I think I would use this one. And let's take a good look at the aiming down sight. So the flower up top is a little bit destructive, but it's not too bad. Again, no back bling. It's not that big. It's not that bulky of a skin. So surprisingly, the aiming down sides is not bad. And let's take a good look at the wrap. It is animated, so it's just going to be, I think you can see part of them blinking on there. And we'll see that in a bigger scale here in a second. Yeah, you can see the smile there on the SMG. So here we have the customized captain with the wrap on there. As you can tell, it is animated. The faces just keep changing on there. So nothing too crazy. Um, I definitely thought it was going to look a little bit cooler, but it is pretty nice, very minimal. You just have all of the faces there alongside the shoulders. Nothing else is animated towards the bottom, but as you can see on the weapon wrap, it looks pretty clean. And here we are. You can see it on the actual pickaxe. So very clean on there. So I do like the weapon wrap. I like the pop of color on there. Definitely a nice one to have. Not the biggest fan of it on the customized captain, but just wanted you to be able to see it on that bigger scale. Let's go ahead and run, jump, slide, and then go ahead and mantle. So we're gonna change out the edit style here and see what it all looks like on the other side. But I do like it during the nighttime. Looks really cool, especially the contrail 
super unique super cool so here is the skin free falling with the other edit style i like this a lot i like the darker effect on there so let's go ahead and land and get a good idea again the physics looks really good it looks like the top has a bit of a glow so that's pretty cool you definitely get a different personality with this darker edit style it looks creepy it looks cool i like it i like it a lot and then the edit style for the pickaxe is gonna be that same darker face there i'm assuming it's gonna be the same react Activity. We have the same contrail, same splash effect. Yeah, I like the face on there. But let's go ahead and see if it is reactive to eliminations or damage being dealt. It looks like it smiled. I like how it goes angry, hit fire. Yeah, so as soon as he gets eliminated, they all smile. It's angry, and then they smile. Okay, so the reactivity is tied with eliminations. And then the faces are just continually changing on there. Looks like when you're fighting, they go serious. And when you eliminate, they smile. But I want to hear from you down in the comments below. What do you think? Is this something that you're going to get? You're going to pass on it? Do you like it? Do you not like it? Do you hate it? Do you like how unique it is? I want to hear from you down in the comments below. And one final thing before we go to the locker. This is a good view of this edit style in the dark. Definitely going to blend in. and gives you a little bit more hiding power here. Except for that big bright flower. When you have the gun, it's less. I mean, it may have you blend even more. People might think that's an actual flower. That's kind of funny. So definitely a big fan. Let's go ahead and go to my locker so I can give you my final thoughts on the entire thing. Let's go. But here we have the Mad Mochi skin. Comes with two different edit styles. The black sesame and the regular one here. I like how some of these have the legs on there. So like this one looks like it's holding up one of the legs <laughs> on the shoulders just sticking out. And then on the neck, it's kind of holding up the head there. The flower on top is a nice touch. I like the vine as the hand and then the connections between the legs on there, the random leaves. And then you have all these phases with different animations on there. You know, it's nice to get a break in between all the skins that come out in Fortnite and being able to have something that's completely random and completely unique is always a nice breath of fresh air. And then the sesame style looks really cool. I think this is going to be a cool skin. It gives me kind of like the Alice in Wonderlands, the, the cat, that face on there. It's very, very creative and can be very creepy, especially with some of these phases that are going on right now. If they were there in the middle of the night and came out of the bush, it would be very freaky. So I'm a big fan of this skin. Very unique. I'm actually pleasantly surprised. I thought it was really stupid when I saw it and wasn't... <laughs> And wasn't looking forward to reviewing it but now that i've used it seen it in game definitely definitely a fan of it so i'm gonna be running it i'm gonna give this one an 8 out of 10. the mochi masher pickaxe here i love the flowers i love the colors and i love that you have the two different edit style that reactivity is nice from just hitting the weak points on there and the contrail and the splash are really really nice so overall a very very clean minimal nice very unique pickaxe so i'm gonna give this one an 8 out of 10 as well i'm gonna be using this one for sure you get the red bean rave so it's a very very bright very i like it on this uh sniper actually but it's very very bright you've got that teal color the pink a little bit of purple the whitish pink on there that are all the mochi and it's got that animation going so i do think it looks great on all of the weapons but i do like it so i'm gonna give this one an 8 out of 10 as well the loading screen is very creepy it gives it creepy vibes so i I like it. It's definitely fitting with the October vibe. Very cool. I'm going to give this one an 8 out of 10 as well. Didn't think I was going to like it, but I do. So I'm going to be running it for sure on one of my live streams. So if you haven't yet, be sure to go follow me at twitch.tv slash Ruben Esparza. But that's going to be it for me on this video, guys. Hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you in the next one.